We're here at the Argonaut Weekly with head men's and women's cross country coach John Bergen. And coach, uh, another strong weekend for the Argonauts in their second uh, meet of the season facing uh, some conference opponents up at the Fleet Feet Invitational hosted by Alabama Huntsville. Uh, the men placing second, the women placing first as uh, UWF has had, you know, the women have won two straight meets now and the men have been either first or second to start the year. Uh, what can you say about the team overall to start the year? Well, we're really happy with how we've started out. I mean, the first two meets we've done very well. And this, the second meet here at uh, Huntsville was a chance for us to start running against some conference opponents and really see where we stand. And on the men's side, it's, uh, it's pretty clear that uh, I think uh, Alabama Huntsville is a team to beat, and we were right with them. We were right on them during the race, and we have a good group of, of veterans on the men's team, and I think they know how close they are and what they need to do uh, to get it done. And on the women's side, there was four or five teams in the, in the conference in that race, and we won the race. Uh, Delta was very close to us, and Huntsville is a pretty strong team as well. So um, shaping up for the women's conference to be five or six teams, a couple teams that weren't in this last weekend's race, uh, to have a shot at winning it, and we're in that group, so it's a good feeling. Coming up this weekend, uh, the team will be heading north up to New York. And first, uh, what are you what are you looking to get out of that meet as a team, as far as performances go, and uh, you know, comparing yourself to the competitions that's gonna, that are, that's going to be there there at the media champions? Well, it's a, it's a great experience for the team to go, you know, to to New York and run the media champions, and it's there's going to be some very good competition. It's a very challenging course. I think for the for the men's team, uh, as I mentioned, we have uh, some veterans that have been around for, for two or three years. They're going to really go and, and see what, what they can do against good competition, not be intimidated or anything. I think for our women, it's going to be, and it's a 6K for the women, and that'll be, uh, you know, that's what we're running the regional, so they get a taste of it early on. Um, I think it's going to be a chance for them just to see where they are and, um, you know, kind of soak it all in with, with a great trip and, and see where they are, because they are pretty young. Our, our men's team, is, as I kind of mentioned, our top four runners have been here at least three years. And for, uh, for actually for the last two years, I had a, an assistant coach, Neil McDonough, a uh, Division I runner, working with that group. And then this year, we have Caleb Carmichael, who was uh, you know all-decade GSC runner, one of the best uh, runners we've had here in the program. So those three have worked with two really good uh, uh, athletes to help train them. And they, they're a really good group of veterans. And this is a great chance for them to run against some Division One competition, and show that they're, you know, they're a pretty good group. And uh, if they can bring some of those freshmen along with them and perform well, we're going to do pretty well by the end of the year. So. And what are you looking uh, forward to in this trip? As far as uh, you know, over the last few years, you've gone uh, to a meet in Arizona, you've gone to one in California, now going up to New York. Uh, as far as uh, you know, this is you know kind of a highlight on the schedule as far as uh, a destination to go to, as far as you know going to New York City. Yeah, it, well, really, what we've we've kind of done over the last few years is kind of had one one meet. It's 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 maybe we call it a fundraising meet. The team has to do some work in order to, to go, but it's a chance to go somewhere different, run against some different competition. And uh, you know, we did we were at Arizona last year, and not only was it some pretty good competition, but it was at altitude and it was early in the year, so it was kind of a good way. Of, getting a little extra training and, and this is still early in the year and this is also some very good competition some of the top division one schools will be there and uh, you know a chance to, to run against a whole different region so uh, and then of course you know to enhance the student athlete experience I mean a lot of them haven't been to New York and you know last year a lot of them haven't been to Arizona so it's a, uh, you know, it's, it is kind of a you know even though we you know we want them to focus on running it is a chance you know it's early in the season that they can take in the experience as well as as uh, you know, getting some uh, some good racing. So the UWF cross country teams will head to New York City this weekend to compete in the Meet of Champions hosted by Iona College. Thanks, Coach Bergen. You're welcome.